All right, water fowlers. We got here, Roger Sporting Goods here. We got a brand new Higdon XS Pulsator. Um, just got these in a couple days ago. Um, guys are really like water motion for their decoy spread. You really need to watch this video. So what this is, if you have if you have a pulsator right now, you know that there is going to be a long cord like this. It's probably was probably maybe three, four foot long that was connected to a big battery tray. It had a big 12 volt battery in there. Well, they've done away with that. They've put a lithium battery inside the duck here. It's inside here. What we're going to do. Um, the charging port is right here. You don't have to ever take that battery out to charge it. It's pretty simple. Basically, you just get your charger, plug it in on the wall. Um, it's an awesome battery. It's not. It's actually probably better than the battery we had before. It's a lithium battery. Um, they've done some other um, design changes to it. I got this float here. I think that's helping it bob up and down a little bit better to cause more motion. So we're gonna show you here what it looks like in this tub I got right here. So to start this thing, you take your, your cord right here, connect it to your uh, bilge pump, and you plug it in right here to where you charge it at. You'll hear it start to go off, right? So I'm gonna put it in this pool. I'm just have you guys watch it a little bit. So actually it looks like I think they also changed the time on it too. Um, there's definitely a longer pause in it compared to the last year's version. So there's that pause right there, and then it's gonna go back. And I want you guys to look at how, if you guys had one of these before, look at how much this one's bobbing up and down. I think those floats on the bottom help that. And maybe the battery also inside the duck. And also the cord, the big three foot cord, four foot cord, not restricting this duck. Cause I think this is actually uh, adding way more water motion than it did before in a previous model. This thing really is bobbing up and down and, and uh, it's, gonna, it's gonna really have some water moving. So what I would do, how I would rig this is you gotta, you gotta do your own rig on this uh, decoy, not like the last one, the actual battery was the rig. Um, what I would do is a, a Texas rig personally, and I would have it pretty long to where nothing's really pulling down on this duck, letting this duck butt, letting this duck butt actually wobble like we're seeing it right now. Because it's adding a lot, of, a lot of motion and a lot of water motion to be. So, and it also comes with the added feature that they did last year, and I'm gonna show you that right now. After this, after this next round, I'm gonna have to pause, I'm gonna get it. So we add this uh, clear tubing in here and it really adds the water motion. We're going to get really wet around here. As you can see, it's a lot more, it's spraying a lot more water right now than it was earlier. So one thing though, pay attention when you do this, we're going to pull it out here. Late season and maybe in January when you spray all that water, it's going to ice all over your decoys. So I would probably do that early season or when it's not freezing. So. What I didn't show you earlier, this is the charging cord right here. Basically you plug that into just where I just unplugged this from, plug it in the wall, you're good to go. So be sure, check it out. Um, the new XS Higdon Pulsator. Come check us out, uh, rogersportinggoods.com.